been a patient of Dr. Batars for one year this coming September. I had the carotid artery blockage, 90% in the right side and 60 in the right uh, left. Now I, there was no physical uh, reactions that you could feel to it, but my wife died, my first wife, from carotid artery blockage. I was a little suspicious, kept a close watch. Oh, I had a uh, blood pressure problem, I had a digestive problem, and uh, just various things. I'm diabetic, and uh, just one thing compounded the other. And as I came up here for the carotid artery problem, Dr. Batar says, I only treat unless I can treat the full body. After a complete thorough physical, the likes of which I haven't had since I went in the Army, the next treatment, he says, uh, throw away your Pepsi. Your digestive problem is not too much acid. It's not enough. Throw away your blood pressure pills. I was borderline anemic after he got through with the regimen of iron treatments. I've got my feelings back. I got a little more energy. Now I go out in the shop and tinker with my antique tractors and toys about three or four days a week before I'd get out about once every two weeks. Now, after all these years as a mechanic, I know that no two jobs go the same, just like no patients, two patients are going to react the same. I told him the first time, I said, now I don't expect you to have it cleared up in three months. It didn't get this way in three months. But after six months, if I can show any kind of a decrease, then you've got a confirmed believer. After six months, I had Dopplers. This one, the same doctor that did them before, bafflingly told me, he said, this one is somewhere between 60 and 80. This one is 45. Down from 90 over here, 60 over here. So I came back and I said, just reserve me a seat every Monday. I like the way he treats you. He goes all the way through. Anything that you're having any problems with, he's taking care of. And I, I really appreciate it. Like I said, after all these years of being in maintenance and repair, you start on something, you want to finish it. You want to do it to where it doesn't come back on you. And that's his, that's his mainstay right there. He, he believes in whatever you've got a trouble or problem with, we're going to treat the, the trouble. We're not going to try to just mask over it. And I asked him myself, why did my doctor, who was seeing me every three months, didn't catch this almost anemic bit going the opposite way on my digestive problem? And I was having to take three blood pressure pills a day. And he says, well, really the, maybe the test that he ran didn't go as thorough as mine. And I said, well, he was getting paid to do the whole job. Why didn't he do it? Well, the wife says I'm a little more alert, uh, a little more myself. Uh, I was getting pretty lethargic there at the last. And I had no ambition, didn't care to get up and do anything. But now, I get up and move around, and nothing else to keep out of her troubles, you know. She'll find something for you to do. As far as the blood pressure, uh, the only thing that he's, I guess clearing the arteries is what's done it. Because it's down now, I take no medication. My blood pressure is uh, about 15 minutes ago, 143 over 68. My wife is a retired CNA every morning. She checks my blood pressure and my blood sugar, and it's running beautiful. Well, I've had to reduce my insulin intake from the diabetes, which is great. And the only thing I can relate it to, naturally you work on a sliding scale, depending on your diet and your activities. But in this case, I suppose it's due to the uh, regimen of, of treatment that he's given me and the reduction of the blockages, I'm way off 
and that is great. I've been on chelation now for mm, let's see, eight months. I've just had my 40th treatment. Hair's growing back on my fingers and on my toes, not on my hair yet, head yet, but uh, that's all right. But uh, all of these are just subtle things that I never expected. I figured, hey, I get the arteries cleaned out, big deal. But if you can get all this other stuff to boot, hey, go for it. I feel a lot better. I've got a lot more energy, a lot more ambition. So far, he's done everything he's told me. He's done more, as much as more than he's promised, and I'm going to stay with him till it's over.